Turin is Italy's third largest economic center after Rome and Milan. In 2004, Turin produced a GDP of €25,439 billion, 2.2% Euros, of the national figure. The Turin Greater Metropolitan Area produced €44,146 billion, 3.8% Euros, of the Italian GDP. Turin's taxable income was €12,455 billion. Euros. Industry The province of Turin, is Italy's second largest export market, in terms of value of exports with a share of 5.2% of the national total. Its industries include manufacturing and engineering, production of confectionery and chocolate, and banking and telecommunications. There has also been growth in construction, tourism and service industries. Founded in 1826, Caffarel, the inventor of Gianduja, is the oldest chocolate factory in the world. Other prominent companies in the area include Fiat, Seat Pagin Jale, EIAR, now Rai, Olivetti, Lavazza, Sirio, Real Mutua Asicurazioni, Toro Asicurazioni Lancia, Italdesign Giugiaro, Ghia, Italgas, Bertoni, Pininfarina, Martini and Rossi, Seven, Kappa, Superga, Carlo Pignatelli. National banks with a presence in Turin include Intesa San Paolo and Unicredit Group. In 2006, there were 231,645 businesses registered in the province of Turin and 112,255 in the city. These numbers represent just under 50% of all those in the Piedmont region and 4% of the Italian total. There were 21,987 foreign entrepreneurs, with the majority being non-EU. Difficulties which industry in Turin has faced include a long phase of industrial restructuring, a crisis in fiat, and transfer of production to developing nations. Automotive data from 2006 indicated that growth in Italian GDP at that time was due to resumption of exports of cars from the fiat group. Associated automotive industries also benefited. Such automotive companies include Iveco, Alfa Romeo, Abart and Lancia, Pininfarina, Bertoni and Giugiaro. General Motors, while breaking a commercial and productive alliance with Fiat, continued research in the testing of diesel engines. The automotive components industry has expanded and modernized in response to Fiat's success. There is a network of over 350 companies, the Turin Chamber of Commerce's From Concept to Car project, involving 145 companies aimed to promote the excellence of the sector throughout the world. Tertiary sector Beginning in the 1980s, tertiary sector industry in Turin has grown in importance. Banking Turin hosts the headquarter of the Intesa San Paolo Banking Group, the second largest banking group in Italy measured by market capitalization. Fondazioni CRT, Real Mutua Asicurazioni, Alianza Toro and Fondieri Asai are also present. Innovative technology in Turin, there are programs, for example, the New Turin Economy Project working to assist collaboration in the private technology sector. Companies and institutions involved include, Polytechnic Institute Mario Boella, Istituto Galileo Ferraris and the Centro Ricerche Fiat CRF, Fiat Research Center, Torino Wireless and the Ministry of University and Research. There is a concentration of such companies at Environment Park and Virtual Reality and Multimedia Park. In January 2009, Reply SPA acquired the Motorola Research Center in Turin in order to initiate research and development programs governing machine to machine M2M, the Internet of Things and cloud computing, all innovative technologies based on the exchange of information and interaction between network devices for automating mission critical processes. Tourism the 2006 Winter Olympics contributed to Turin's progress after a period of economic doldrums. However, some were not sure of its effect. Giorgetto Giugiaro, whose classic industrial designs range from Canon cameras to VW, said, Turin is a modest city intent on doing things. If the villas we have in La Colinas were in Milan, people would call them the Beverly Hills of Europe. But our problem is that we are not able to talk about what we have, Giugiaro told me about a friend who owns two Rolls Royces but won't take them out, for fear of showing off. So he drives around town in an ordinary car and leaves his rolls in the garage. The city's Versace store had to close because locals wouldn't be caught dead in such ostentatious clothes, and Hermes has to stop plain white paper shopping bags so patrons can carry its understated luxury home without risking any fashion statements along the way. In 2008, the Turin area was visited by 5.3 million tourists. 
Recent changes The conversion of large urban areas, previously occupied by factories has contributed to recent economic growth. Large public works such as Pasante Ferroviario di Torino and the Metro, have also reshaped the city. Since 2000, Turin, as a place of origin of Italian cinema has housed the National Museum of Cinema at Mole Antonelliana. In 2008, with 532,196 visitors, it reached the 13th most visited place among Italian museums. Cineporto, a multi-purpose facility dedicated to high-tech film productions and the Lumix Studios, which produces film, television and advertising. References, <references>